you really don't know uh, just how much it can affect and that we're so grateful it didn't affect this whole community as in it could have been a lot worse. An Indianapolis family is dealing with a lot of unknowns tonight after their family home of more than 20 years exploded last week. CBS4's Eric Gray spoke to family members of those injured in the blast about what happened and what's next. It's a total miracle. I mean, there's no other other words to describe it. David Hermsman, Penny Joe Hermsman, and Joshua Long say they still have no idea how everyone survived the explosion here on Rivalt Avenue on Friday morning. It seems impossible when you think about it. In the explosion, their mother Penny Hermsman, little brother Zach Long, and his girlfriend Ari McCreary were all hurt. Ari is currently in the hospital with a collapsed lung. Penny is recovering from spine surgery, and Zach has some burns. Because it could have. Ended very, very badly, a lot worse than what it was. The Wayne Township Fire Department says the cause of the fire is right down here, a gas line below the family's fire pit. They say they've had this fire pit for years, but we're just recently digging a little bit deeper. It was a freak accident. Hersman says gas leaked into the house, and then when a cigarette was lit Friday morning, everything exploded. They credit their brother Zach with getting everyone out alive. When he just went into a survival mode and uh, did what he had to do, and, and for that we commend him because if, if, he, if he wouldn't have done that, we wouldn't have had our mom today. Now as Penny, Zach, and Ari recover from their injuries, the rest of the two families are trying to do anything they can to help. Um, we've got some of the bare necessities just to get some kind of normalcy back for the ones that don't have a home anymore because those little things make a big difference. They have GoFundMe set up and are asking for clothing donations, all while looking forward to when their family is back together again. I, I can't tell you what I'll do to hear my mom say, I love you, baby, you know, right now. It's, it's, uh, I know she's going to get to that. On the west side, Eric Graves, CBS4 News.